they're both incredibly good players. Uh, Super Kitty's probably gonna go Yoshi, and Toad is probably gonna go Inkling. Yeah, Toad has a pretty good Inkling. Yeah, Toad's Inkling is really good. He's he's definitely one of the best players here. Uh, but Super Kitty's pretty good too. He's gotten some really good results. Yeah, his Yoshi is definitely forcing the record there. Something I uh, have to go against. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, like I've I've played against his Inkling a lot, and lately it's been so hard. So hard. Yeah. Yeah, and like he's really good at landing his kill moves. Like, uh, it's so just between his use of, like, the way he uses ink roller and uh, up throw up air, it's just so hard to not die when I'm playing against him. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, what we're seeing is that they're both moving around a lot. Seeing neither of them have any interest in being. So we're seeing that Toad's mostly controlling the ground while Super Kitty is staying in the air. Ooh, interesting jab exchange. So let's see who gets the first big opening here. So you see they're both playing really patient. They're both fishing for an opening. And ooh, there, that to to Toad's got him inked. That's, yeah. Oh, oh no. Yeah. Oh my goodness, and he's fully inked, so he's going to take a lot of damage. Uh, but Super Kitties, he's showing that he means business. Yeah, like honestly, it's pretty even now. And he's losing his ink. And then, uh, no, that's not kill percent, but it is now. Oh, yep. Ooh, interesting. Didn't, didn't quite link into itself the way I think Toad intended it to. But then, yeah. Sometimes you can just forward air. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, ooh! I think he burned his jump. Oh, okay. I, I was real scared there for a bit. Uh, yeah. Oh, that almost killed. Yeah. Ooh, interesting egg strats. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Yeah, Toad's so hard to kill himself. Like, like he's just so good at moving. Oh, yeah! Ooh, I saw him put... I saw him do a forward air, and then... And sometimes that happens. You just use a move, and that extends your hurtbox and gets you killed. Oh, and now he's buried. That's, that's okay. Yeah, Yoshi's really heavy. So, but now he's inked at 150. That's not good. Ooh. And then for it again. So I don't want to totally rule Super Kitty out here. I've seen him make good comebacks. Yeah. And like Toad's a high percent. It's not as big of a lead oh as a. Goodness, yep, and he closed out the gap. Yo. Yeah, this is exciting. Hmm? Yeah, this is gonna be real fun. Yeah. So this reminds me of the way the match began, where both players are just looking for an opening, and then, ooh, <sighs> Toad got his opening, but unfortunately he dropped it by pummeling. And now he has ink. So now he's... So let, let's see if Super Kitty can avoid taking damage while he's inked. Oh, he was just about to lose his ink, and now he's inked more. Uh, unfortunate. I, I hope he doesn't dislike default color Yoshi, because it looks like that's what he's playing with half this match. <laughs> oh, okay, he's gonna live. Yeah, I think kill percent for that's like 110 or something, just based on watching this. But yeah, he is. But Super Kitty could easily turn this around. Like, we've seen him kill at this percent before. Oh, oh, I think, oh, yeah. You're just seeing how scary Toad is when he... Just busts out a kill move out of nowhere. 
Yeah. Yeah. And I'm excited to see where the rest of the set goes. Ah, FD, interesting choice. Honestly, probably not a bad choice on Super Kitty's part. Uh, having no platforms to assist with up throw up air is probably really good for Yoshi. Although, actually, oh, Toad's switch. Oh, they're switching characters. Ooh. This reminds me of Smash 4 a lot. Like, I was a Luigi main in that game, and Luigi versus Fox is a matchup I was very familiar with. Uh, I wonder who's. I don't know whose favorite it is in this game, but like I think it's still Luigi's favorite like last time, despite all the Luigi nerfs. Yeah, like Luigi. Ooh, and yeah, Nair. Uh, yeah, you just yeah, Luigi. That's that's the big thing Luigi has uh, going for him. He just does so much damage so quickly. Ooh, parry to jab in between his. Wow. Interesting. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, Luigi's hard for Fox. Like, he just, like, Fox takes so much damage from... Starfinger! Yeah, lit... He's just like, Starfinger! <laughs> yeah. Oh, man, Nair to up smash. That's... Rough, because that, that's the thing though, it's a really volatile matchup, because both characters do so much damage, maybe a little more so for Luigi, and then they both kill really quickly. Yeah, so like, this is a really, like, you can never tell who's in the lead in this matchup, because anyone can bring it back. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's something I used to do all the time against Foxes. Uh, in Smash 4, you actually had to crawl in order to dodge the lasers. Uh, because, uh, when he was crouching, he'd peek his head up and look around a little bit. Uh, and I guess now that's not a thing. You can just crouch. Yeah. Ooh, interesting on stage down air. Wonder if we're going to see some plungers from... Oh, the up smash! Yeah. Ooh, ooh, he's doing damage! He's doing damage! Oh, ooh, he avoided the up air. Ooh, the plunger! Aww. Oh. That's, that's a thing. Uh, down tilt two frames. Yeah, it's really good at two framing. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah, it's gonna be exciting. So, fun fact about Luigi's down tilt, uh, in this in this game, uh, the total duration of the move from the first frame to the first frame you can act is 14 frames. Around half the typical jab one. It's incredibly fast. Uh, so you can just rapid fire down tilts. Yeah. Ooh, I'm not. Sh then again, this was Toad. This was Toad's choice. So very good stage to pick with Inkling, I think, because those it's a low ceiling stage, I th think. And also the platforms can really help him with the. But then again, it's Luigi. He can't do up throw up air. Yeah, like. Yeah. Yeah. So, so you see Toad has really good stage control right now, but we're also seeing that Super Kitty's finding plenty of openings to hit him on. Oh, those down tilts are kind of slow. But 
But yeah, Toad just he has such good stage control in this matchup. Especially on Yoshi's. Oh. Yeah. And not a good position for Luigi. Unfortunate. And opening the stock with the the jab combo. It's not An old take is like a, a good up smash. Also seeing that Super Kitty's really struggling to find those openings. Fortunately missed the star finger and took another jab. Really? This seems like a really rough matchup for Luigi. Oh, didn't use the down B to escape. That's <sighs> Super Kitty can still make this comeback, but Toad's just it's on fire this match. Ah, oh, and then uh. so we're seeing the start of Super Kitty's potential comeback. Question is, will it be enough? So they both have roughly comparable stage positions. That's a rough way for it to end. 